the teacher and his practice in a remote classroom. A case of education in the face of emergency. Claudia Camacho Real and Patricia La Torre Rojo. Virtual University System. University of Guadalajara, Mexico. The study addresses the identification of teacher practices observed from the teaching learning activities implemented in the response to the health contingency caused by COVID-19. The practice work modified and adapted to reality. This configured a teaching role and its characteristics. characteristics. International context. The pandemic led to the closure of schools and the suspension of the face-to-face -face education. The SEP happened without a margin of preparation time or a period of training. National context. Mexican federal and state educational authorities proposed an education with the use of technological tools. In many cases, the face-to-face -face courses was moved to remote classroom. remote classroom. The teaching role, the educational methods, and the materials weren't defined, although it received government regulations from each state or federal identity. Federal identity. Method. Method. The nature of the study is descriptive. The observation of the method guides methodologically approach to recognize the particular and the unique and the complex of reality. The observation work was carried out with the teacher and his students, a group of fourth grade elementary school. The observation of daily remote activities took place discreetly without any interventionist desire. desire. We ask, how did teachers carry out teaching learning practice in the remote environment during the health emergency? How was the teaching role shaped in their daily practice? Daily practice? For the case study, we select three topics. Hypothesis. The teaching practice in a remote educational environment are related to the practice characteristics of the school, the computer culture, and the availability of access to technology. technology. Results and discussion. We found that the activity sequences were disposed in three moments, before synchronous class and post remote class. Synchronizing facilitation. We found the category distance as a psychological space. Teachers often say, we are together in the distance. Moore considers this distance as a transition that allows covering the separation of space and the time between teachers and students. This distance must be crossed strong through the close dialogue and strategies to configure active participation. participation. We found up in the next sequence follow-up and feedback many characteristics like the communication was personalized, informative, on time, objective, and had social and emotional uh, styles that make students have a, po a motivated and positive attitude. If attitude. Another category was surveillance for ordering behavior. Many teachers say cameras on and microphones off. And one might ask how to rethink disciplinary procedures imposed on more consensual that make a sense of social agreement where the norm is proposed and discussed by group. The challenge of ordering behavior remain open to Latin to be addressed like a thought bowl, where it's worth asking how to turn process focus on efficiency and control more to trust, self-regulation, motivation in a human and recent way. Recent way. Independent work. In this space, teachers work with textbooks, solve problems, make models, write and watch videos, among other activities on their own. Activities on their own. Teaching role. This role in its agency configured a binomic interaction 
and this puts on the table implications of non horizontal dialogue in the construction of learning and social coexistence. Social coexistence. Con conclusions. The technological pedagogical innovation established a re-engineering of classroom routines using new spaces and time for organization through the Google Classroom platform. The evolved task was assumed as a strategy for students understanding their own achievements and the guide to improve difficulties. Performance of the teacher's evidence training of the management of virtual tools. However, on the table, it's important to reflect how can we generate new enriched teaching practice mediated by ICT.